Imagine flying through space in a rocket ship heading straight for Venus, Earth's fiery cousin. But forget about lush green fields and cool breezes. Venus is more like a boiling cauldron where the air is heavy and the ground is scorching hot. In just five seconds on this sizzling planet, every breath is a battle and every step is risky. But don't worry. We're taking you on a wild ride to see this extreme world. Get ready to face the heat and discover what makes Venus so intense. Are you up for the challenge? Let's blast off, but hold on tight. Before we zoom off, hit that subscribe button to catch more amazing journeys like this one. Don't forget to click the icon so you never miss out on our awesome adventures exploring the cosmos. The atmosphere of Venus. Venus has a thick atmosphere filled with carbon dioxide and clouds of sulfuric acid. The air pressure on Venus is super strong, about 92 times more than what we feel on Earth's surface. These conditions make Venus a tough place for anything to survive. Imagine standing on Venus. The air would feel heavy and thick, making it hard to breathe. The heat is scorching, enough to melt metal. And those clouds in the sky? They're not fluffy like on Earth, but made of dangerous sulfuric acid. If you tried to visit Venus without special equipment, the air pressure would crush you flat like stepping on a soda can. Even machines have a hard time surviving in Venus's harsh environment. Even spaceships struggle to survive in Venus's harsh environment, highlighting the challenges of space exploration. It's a reminder of how extreme and unforgiving the conditions on Venus truly are, making it one of the most hostile places in our solar system. Temperature conditions. Venus is super hot, like a blazing oven turned all the way up. Its surface can reach a scorching 465 degrees Celsius, 869 degrees Fahrenheit, hotter than anything we're used to on Earth. It's so hot that it can even melt lead. If you were to step onto Venus without protection, it would feel like being surrounded by flames. Your skin would burn and the air would be too hot to breathe. Even the strongest spaceships or suits wouldn't last long in this fiery furnace. Surviving on Venus, even for a few seconds, would be incredibly tough. It's a reminder of just how extreme and hostile the conditions on Venus really are. Gravitational effects. Venus's gravity is about 90% of Earth's, meaning objects would feel slightly lighter there. However, this difference would hardly be noticeable during a short exposure. You might feel a bit lighter on your feet, but it wouldn't be dramatically different from Earth's gravity. Five seconds on Venus. Let's imagine spending just five seconds on Venus. As soon as we step onto the planet's surface, we're immediately engulfed in a wave of scorching heat, with temperatures soaring to a blistering 465 degrees Celsius. Second one, the intense heat shock hits us like a sledgehammer, causing immediate discomfort as our skin feels like it's on fire. The surrounding air, thick with carbon dioxide, makes breathing difficult, and our lungs struggle to draw in oxygen. Second two, simultaneously, the crushing atmospheric pressure, about 92 times stronger than Earth's, bears down on us, making it feel like an invisible weight is pressing down on our bodies. Any unprotected spacecraft would crumple under this immense pressure, much like a soda can being crushed. Second three, the clouds made of sulfuric acid start to eat away at anything metal they touch, like spacesuits or spacecraft. They would break down really fast in this acid air. Second four, our skin exposed to the extreme heat begins to blister and burn within seconds. Without proper protection, any prolonged exposure would result in severe thermal burns and tissue damage. Second five, as we gasp for breath in the toxic air, our bodies strained under the intense heat and pressure. We realize the impossibility of survival in such harsh conditions. Only advanced technology such as heat resistant suits and spacecraft designed to withstand extreme environments could offer even a fleeting chance of survival on Venus. In just five seconds, Venus shows us how tough space exploration can be and why we need super smart technology to keep us safe. Tech Challenges 
Thankfully, clever scientists back on Earth designed some pretty amazing suits for us. These high-tech wonders shield us from the scorching heat, which can reach a mind-blowing 475 degrees C that's hot enough to melt lead. We wouldn't want to be caught out here in our swimming trunks, that's for sure. These suits are like wearable spaceships, protecting us from the extreme temperatures and crushing pressure of Venus. With their advanced materials and cooling systems, they make exploring this fiery planet possible, even if just for a short while. So, let's suit up for the adventure of a lifetime on Venus. Exploring. But we're not here for a relaxing spa day on a hot planet, remember or not. We're on a mission. With careful steps, we are going to investigate the alien landscape, collect rock samples, take pictures, and gather data like space detectives on a scorching hot case. Every piece of information we collect helps us unravel the secrets of this mysterious planet. Our journey doesn't just focus on the present. We also look back at the brave robots who dared to visit Venus before us. Remember the Soviet probe Venera 13? These these courageous machines paved the way for our mission, sending back valuable information and showing us just how brutal the Venusian environment can be. Their legacy reminds us of the immense challenges we face, but also inspires us to keep pushing forward. The rewards of exploration. Looking back on this journey, we're filled with a deep sense of accomplishment. Despite the risks, we've not only learned a ton about Venus, but also gained invaluable insights into the challenges of space space travel. This mission is a testament to the human spirit, our insatiable thirst for knowledge, and our unwavering courage in the face of the unknown. The close call leaves its mark. The burns take weeks, maybe even months, to heal, leaving behind a permanent reminder of the dangers encountered. But the experience also brings a newfound appreciation for the life-giving conditions on Earth. We return with a renewed sense of purpose, determined to use our knowledge of Venus to develop better heat-resistant technology for future space exploration. Conclusion. Now, back to Earth. Our journey to Venus was like a wild roller coaster ride, full of ups and downs, twists and turns. We faced tough challenges and scary moments, but we also discovered amazing things along the way. Even though Venus is a tough place to visit, we didn't give up. With our special suits and brave hearts, we explored its fiery landscape and learned so much. From the scorching heat to the heavy air, everything on Venus was super intense. But our adventure isn't over yet. We've got big dreams for the future, like setting up cool research stations or even turning Venus into a second Earth. It might sound like something from a movie, but with all we've learned, it could become real someday. So, as we say goodbye to Venus for now, let's remember the awesome journey we had. It taught us to never give up, to keep exploring, and to always dream big. Who knows what other amazing places we'll discover next. The universe is full of surprises, and we're ready for whatever comes our way. What did you think of our adventure to Venus? Did you enjoy learning about the challenges and discoveries we face? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Also, we'd love to hear your ideas for our next video. What topic would you like us to explore next? Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more exciting content. By subscribing, you'll be the first to know when our next video drops, so you won't miss out on any of the action-packed adventures ahead. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.